Brahmeshwar or Brahmeshwara Temple is solely dedicated to Lord Shiva, one of the oldest and finest designed temple located in capital and temple city Bhubaneswar of Odisha. The temple is very beautifully carved inside and outside. The style of the ancient temple is the most attracting view for the visitors in terms of history and architecture. It is believed that the temple was built in the 9th century, but as per records and information it was built during the Somavamsi dynasty in 11th century by Kolavati Devi mother of the king Udyodkesri. The temple is classified as a Panchatnaya temple where apart from the main shrine, there are other four subsidiary shrines in the four corners around the temple and large square tank. The temple is built with traditional architectural methods of wood carving, but it is applied on stone building. The temple is divided in the major two part, one is Vimana and second is the Jagmohana. Brahmeshwara temple resembles to the Mukteswara temple in many ways. It is the popular temple among tourists and devotee from hundreds of years for its beautifully designed campus and thornily built structure in mix of Kalinga and Lingaya architectural style. The sandstone walls are very nicely carved with various celestial deities attract all. The carvings over the door frame contain beautiful flower design as well as flying figures. Like the Rajrani, there are images of the eight directional guardian deities. The Chamunda appears on the western facade, holding a trident and a human head standing on a corpse. Outside walls of the temple are adorned with gods and goddesses, Lord Shiva in form of Nataraja, carvings of birds and animal etc. The temple is classified as a Panchatnaya temple where apart from the main shrine, there are four subsidiary shrines in the four corners around the temple. The temple on account of its later origin has a perfectly developed structure compared to its predecessors. The Vimana of the temple is 18.96 m, 62.2 feet tall. The temple is built with traditional architectural methods of wood carving but applied on stone building. The buildings were built in a shape of full volume pyramid and then they would be carved inside and outside. The total area of the land is 208.84 sqm and the temple is built on an area of 181.16 sqm. The basic structure of the Orison temple has two connecting buildings. The smaller is the Jagmohana or assembly hall. Behind it is the Shikra, the towering sanctuary. Later temples have two additional halls in front, one for dancing and the other for banquets. The Brahmeshwara shows quite a bit of affinity with the much earlier Mukteshwar temple including the carved interior of the Jagmohana and in the sculptural iconography such as the lion head motif which appeared for the first time in the Mukteswara and is here evident in profusion. There are quite a number of innovations, however, including the introduction of a great number of musicians and dancers, some holding lutes, on the exterior walls. For the first time in temple architectural history, iron beams find their first use. On sandstone walls, there are symbolic decorations and the notion of godlike figures that help the believer in his meditation. The carvings over the door frame contain beautiful flower designs as well as flying figures. Like the Rajrani, there are images of the eight directional guardian deities. There are also quite a number of tantric related images and even Chamunda appears on the western facade holding a trident and a human head standing on a corpse. Shiva and other deities are also depicted in their horrific aspects. 
Here in Temple Queen Kolavati presented the first inscriptional reference of Devdasi tradition in Bhuvaneshwar temples. Devdasi were maidens devoted to the worship and entertainment activity like dance, music for the presiding deity. The Mahashivratri festival is very well celebrated with thousands of participants every year. Also Purnima of sacred month Kartik and Diwali are celebrated with great zeal. The roads are very well connected to reach Bhubaneswar from the major cities of Odisha. The railway station and the airport both are available from Bhubaneswar itself thus devotee and tourist can reach easily.